So this particular fuel pump is a pusher pump. So this is the bottom side of the tank. You see on the L, uh, the L metal piping that's coming out for the fuel line comes around and then the pipe or the rubber tubing goes into the fuel filter back into the uh, fuel pump and then you got your positive and negative wires. Uh, you got your negative ground wire right there on the firewall and then the positives going up. Uh, you'll see in just a second. All right, so I ran my power wire up uh, through here. I'm going to secure it and hide it and all that stuff. Um, but just make sure that when you're testing which one to hook it up to, I mean, this one in particular, it's, you know, requesting to put a 3 amp inline fuse. So it's not a lot of amperage. Um, but you just want to make sure that it's not running when the switch is off, you know. So when you're testing, you know, use a multimeter or something, or just even a, uh, you know, like a test light. Um, test to make sure that what, whichever one of these you choose to run off of um, is not on when the switch is off. And it is on when the switch is on. And then hook it to that one. So on the 63, <clears throat> I'm pretty sure that didn't modify this one. Um, it's the far right one. I believe it's also for the radio. So that's the one I hooked up to. But when you turn it on, obviously it'll it'll work. 